Hello there, my name's Ashley Shaw and I'd like to speak to you today about the incident that happened in Texas yesterday and the shooting of two suspected terrorists. Now the whole point here is the issue of freedom of speech and for those of you that aren't aware, and although I'm sure all of you are aware, um, a very small, insignificant little group of racist and religious bigots held a um, event in Texas during which there was a competition with a reward of £10,000 for the best cartoon of the Prophet Muhammad. Um, they cited free speech as the reason for you know being able to do this in the first place. Now, I'm, at this present moment in time, I don't want to tackle the issue about the, the people that were shot because we don't know any more information. But what I do want you to understand is that freedom of speech does not extend to the publication and the drawings of the Prophet Muhammad. I mean, this is extremely insulting to two billion people across the world. Two billion people find it offensive. Therefore, you cannot continue to use the Prophet Muhammad as an example of freedom of speech, especially when freedom of speech doesn't ex extend to other um, religions, such as you aren't allowed to... Uh, say anything against Jewish people, and rightly so, because hatred is hatred. Hatred is hatred and it's wrong, no matter which area it's directed in. But I'm sick and tired of individuals citing freedom of speech whilst making the most provocative actions. I mean, because that's what it is. They know fine well that producing these cartoons is upsetting. I mean, more than upsetting to two billion people. So, no you know showing pictures of the prophet that's not freedom of speech that's provocative action that is racist and religious bigots trying to cause trouble and in fact this small group extremely small group nobody had really heard of before um there was ten thousand dollars spent on the police protection because they thought there would be lots of protests outside this to me sounds extremely dodgy um, it's, you know, suddenly we're all going to know about this really small and significant little group. Well, I say this to you people. If you think that portraying the Prophet Muhammad is freedom of speech, then shame on you. It isn't. It's extremely insulting to two billion Muslims around the world and extremely provocative if you're going to do such a thing. Have some respect for other people's beliefs have some respect for other people's beliefs. Islamophobia, this global Islamophobia that is rising at the moment is not going to be tolerated. And this kind of action is just Islamophobia, nothing more. Don't be fooled by this erroneous claim of freedom of speech. It's nothing more than Islamophobia and it has to be stamped out. Thank you.